What is going on guys? Devin here, aka Miss Spell Drubble, and welcome back to another live stream of the Long Dark. Uh, this just happens to be like the perfect live stream game. Uh, just for the simple fact that it's not too visually taxing on my system. Um, <clears throat> and it's really not a, a visually taxing game. So I can run it at 720p on um, Twitch and not have any sort of issue with it not looking good. Uh, it looks looks just fine, you know what I mean? Like, it looks alright in 720p. Uh, as long as I keep those frames at 60 FPS, we should be doing alright. Um, and basically, though, I am going to try and start streaming a little bit more. Um, maybe a couple scheduled streams, like Saturday and Friday night or something like that. Probably not Friday night. Maybe, maybe Saturday night and um, Thursdays or something. I'm not entirely sure. I might try and set up, like, a little stream schedule for those of you who kind of want to participate in the stream, you know, you can chat with me or give me little suggestions, and I'll be playing simple games at first and then kind of develop them over time, do some things that are a bit more serious. Uh, but at the moment, you know, we're just going to try and do uh, a little test stream here. So basically, if you've been following my uh, my YouTube channel, I have kind of gone dark for the past two days. Um, all my comments have been coming through my phone, uh, not through my computer. I haven't been able to upload any videos. That is because I got a new wireless modem and router. Um, and unfortunately with my work schedule, I it, it took me a long time to get it set up. So I set them up, I got them going, um, they were doing pretty good. And um, well, I, well, it seemed like it was doing our, pretty good. And then all of a sudden, I couldn't get connected on my computer or on my Xbox or any of that stuff. Uh, so... I did a lot of troubleshooting, and I was up pretty late, and I couldn't figure it out. And then I, I went to bed, I woke up, went to work, came home, uh, did some more troubleshooting and all that kind of fun stuff. And uh, I finally figured out that I needed to call my cable provider, or my internet provider, and um, get my modem activated, because I got a new modem too. And it was just kind of frustrating. But finally, I do have it up, and uh, we are we're cooking along here. I'm getting a pretty good, steady internet stream. Um, it's not as high as I would like. I think I need to get a signal booster for uh, my office area here, well, my recording area, um, which is basically a desk next to my bed. <laughs> super high tech, super fancy here. But yeah, I do uh, I do need to get a signal booster because I should be able to get a better signal than what I'm getting right now. My internet's actually not that bad at all. I have pretty good internet. But the modem and router, for a long time, were holding me back. Um, not so anymore. Um, like I said, I did get a new modem and router, so it's pretty stable. I haven't had any crashes. My upload times have been... Well, I, I have yet to really see if they're actually shorter. They seem to be like they're going to be shorter. Uh, I am starting an upload on a video. I just started it before I started the stream. Um, and it seemed like it was a little bit shorter than it normally is. Um, but you know, time will tell. And, uh, for those of you wondering too, I went with the Archer, shoot, what was it, Archer C7, the TP-Link Archer C7, uh, as my wireless router. I know it's not the best in the world, but it's, uh, it's good enough for me. I'm not. Uh, I'm not going to complain about it. It's doing pretty good. I uh, I've been able to play some online on my Xbox without any issues. Usually, like before, with my my modem and router, I've had them for a long time, and we actually had them through a uh, house fire when I was younger. I could have just popped that guy. I had them through a house fire when I was younger, so they had like some smoke damage and stuff. And really, we should not have been using them anymore. Um, but we still were. You know, we we didn't go out and buy new ones. And it just, like, was slowly starting to die. You can ask, I mean, like, if I tried to uh, Skype call people, it would just crash. Um, one, of the, one of the guys who watches my videos, I'm Echo, uh, I tried to do a Skype call with him so we could play some CSGO. Uh, we would get some, uh, some pretty bad interruptions where, like, he would say something and he couldn't hear me, or I would say something and he couldn't hear me. I'm pretty sure I just said the same thing twice. But anyway, you, you get the picture. Um, hopefully that should all be solved. Uh, I've searched this already. I think I've searched this like five times. Um, but yeah, hopefully that should all be solved now and we shouldn't have an issue. Uh, did I just hear a woodpecker? Pretty sure I just heard a, heard a woodpecker. 
or a jackhammer. If it was a jackhammer, that'd be pretty cool. Um, yeah, anyway. Alright, so I should be able to stream and stuff like that and uh, do Skype and upload uh, quicker videos and all that kind of fun stuff. So that should uh, smooth out this process a little bit. Um, but yeah, anyway, I'm, I'm pretty pumped about that. There are a lot of freaking deer running around me. They just don't care that I'm walking through their land here with a hunting rifle. They're just like, eh, he's good. He's not going to kill us. They know I'm not going to. I mean, my inventory is pretty, pretty full. It's cold out here, apparently. My inventory is pretty stocked full. Um, I'm already three kilograms over, which in pounds is multiple. Uh, <laughs> I don't, I don't know conversion rates. I live in America. We're lazy and we don't need to learn that stuff. Which is actually really stupid, because if you think about it, like most of the world uses metrics. Actually, almost all of the world uses metrics. We're one of the very few places that uses the standard or the U.S. standard system. And it doesn't make any freaking sense. Like, when you're, oh, there's 12 inches in a foot. There are three feet in a yard. Like, what? Why? Why can't there be 10, and then 10, and then 10, or 100? Like, metrics just make sense, but we're too dumb to realize that and switch over. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm, I guess I'm part of the problem, because I don't think I'd want to learn metrics. Like, I don't, I would rather know miles per hour rather than kilometers per hour. Uh, it's just me, you know, actually I think that's probably most of America. Um, we just kind of assume that it doesn't matter. When, I mean, it really does. When you're trying to do business or even like talk on the phone or watch a YouTube video from someone who's using a different, oh shit, I'm gonna die. Uh, <laughs> from someone who's using a different scale of measurement, it's really actually difficult to follow along with what's going on. You know, if someone tells me that they drove 120 kilometers per hour the other day, I'm like, wow, that seems really fast. But I don't think it is. I think it's like 80 miles per hour. And I drive that fast on the highway all the time. Legally, I should say. I actually don't drive that fast. I drive 65 um, everywhere I go it, that it's allowed. Uh, so if a policeman's watching this, I don't do anything wrong. I'm a good kid. But yeah, I don't know. It's weird. I don't get the whole conversion. And I know people who uh, use metric don't understand the U.S. system, so it's just all screwed. We should all just start speaking Spanish and counting in Chinese or something. I don't think I've gone this way. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I might have broken an ankle, but don't worry about that. I don't really know exactly where I'm I think I, I mean I have a general idea I've been here before obviously I have a general idea of where I am I think if I keep going this way I'll hit the dam which is what I want to do I'm gonna use the dam to get to the new area because I've like almost explored everything possible here do I have my bedroll with me I don't um I should really have my bedroll do I have anything that like is unimportant I have some wood some tools I have two knives why do I have two knives and I have a snare trap. We gotta try and use that. That'd be pretty cool. Um, actually, you know what? I think if I go up here and I see that the dam's here, I'm gonna head back to the house on the lake. Um, the like the park office. I'm gonna grab my bedroll and I'm gonna set up the snare. Yeah. Okay. So there's the dam. I'm gonna go this way. Uh, I'm gonna set up the snare. I'm going to grab my bedroll, and um, we'll head through the dam. There's a wolf over there eating a deer. That's the best time. To kill them because if you kill the wolf they usually only take like one bullet and that way too you'll get the deer's meat and hide and the wolf's meat and hide uh, so you basically you get two kills with one bullet good efficient way to uh, to do that there sorry if I seem a little bit distracted I am trying to basically shut my freaking phone up uh, it's kind of blown up right now we're I'm planning on with a couple people from work we're planning on going out tonight and uh, getting dinner and whatnot and it's just they everyone texts you at one time and not in a group message either which would be nice because then we could all just reply to each other and we don't we don't think that way we're we're dumb that's what we do I wish this ice could like break I mean it would suck if you're just walking here and all of a sudden the ice breaks but immersion people I'm going for realism that's what I care about I think I'm going the long way too to get to the lake 
Uh, maybe not. Maybe this is the opening up here. I gotta say, too, so... I've been recording videos on my channel. I've put, on average, probably one up per day for the past year and a half. Um, it's a lot of videos. I mean, that's a lot of work to do. If you guys have ever done videos before, you know how much effort goes into a recording and then editing and uploading. It takes a lot of work. One thing I have to say that I really do love about live streaming is that it, it feels just so much more relaxed. Like, you just, you boot up your system, you uh, you sign into Twitch, you just start live streaming, you start talking, you have a good time. You know, you got a drink next to you in case you end up uh, losing your, your steam a little bit halfway through. Um, I've even watched streams where people like, I don't, I don't know why I was watching the stream. I watched the Bob Ross stream for like a week straight, um, which was just phenomenal, by the way. But I've watched streams before where like some dude is sitting there with no shirt on eating potato chips while he like watches theater mode of Call of Duty. And I didn't stay around in that stream for too long. I just, I've seen it and you can't unsee it once you've seen it. It's just, it's weird. Um, but yet he's got people watching it for some reason, and I think people just want to tune in to see his awesome pecs, but who knows, it's just, I should probably set my snare trap up here, huh? I'm going to do that, because I actually, I know exactly how to get here. Let's see how to do this here. We're going to place it. I kind of want to place it, like, right... I want to place it right here, apparently. Alright, um, we'll come back this way after we pick up the bedroll and drop some stuff off and see if we've caught anything. That'll be pretty interesting. Can I bait it? I don't know what you would put there for rabbits. I mean like... Oh, uh, leave it. Leave it up. Okay, we can't bait it. I mean, I guess you put like... Are there carrots in this game? I don't think so. We're in Canada. Do you Canadians have carrots? I don't... I mean, you have to have carrots of some sort. Maybe. I don't know. a rabbit up on the hill. They're freaking stalking me. They're hunting me right now. I'm being hunted by rabbits. That's a deer, right? Not a wolf? Yeah, okay. I'm at the point in the game, too, where I don't really care about the wolves anymore. It's the freaking bears you gotta watch out for. Those things will jack you up so quickly. Here is the river southern access. So if I go out here and just take a right, I'll be back at the, um... Back at the... Yeah, see, we got a wolf over there. I that maybe I have to go over there. Hold up. No. I gotta go out and right, I think. I believe, in order to get back to... Don't you come near me. Don't do it. Shoot, I gotta go that way. He's coming at me? No. He's going after a deer? No, he's running away. What the hell? I don't know why... Why he decided to leave me alone. How many bullets do I have? Because I think I kind of want to kill it. I have ten shots. I'm going to kill it. My fingers feel numb. Got it! One shot, one kill. That is one thing I love about Call of Duty Black Ops is when you, uh... You get those kills, like... At the end of the game, you get to actually, like, taunt people and stuff. Like, that is... That's cool. Come on. We'll take some meat. Hopefully I don't die doing this. I'll be super freaking mad if I die. I'm gonna die, aren't I? Why is he making noises like he's orgasming? Um, yeah. That wasn't too bad. We got some meat. We got some guts. We got a pelt. Um, I'll just drop all of that in here. Because I've got a lot of stuff curing in here already. So, why did I feel like I got stuck there? I have a lot of stuff curing in here already. Where the f... There we go. Um, and I just want to check the progress on that, and we'll drop the other stuff there, and it'll start to cure too. But yeah, we'll drop off some stuff so we're not encumbered anymore, and we can just full out sprint. And, uh, then we'll... We'll, uh... Head on over to the dam. And see what's, what's going on. Sorry about that, my phone, again, is going... You can probably hear it, because it's right underneath my microphone, I just realized. Uh, vibrating. Is this deer... Harvested? It's pretty frozen, but, I mean... This has a lot of meat, holy shnikey. 
Uh, if I use something, we'll take hatchet. Hatchet takes less time. We'll use the hatchet and hopefully not die. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hurry up. Okay. Thank Jesus. Woo! Okay. I wonder if you can shoot a crow out of the sky. I don't know. We'll have to find out, though. Um, how is my stuff doing? 47, 69, 69, 64, 37. Not, not great, but not bad. Uh, let's drop these pelts real quick. Drop that. Drop the wolf pelt. Drop all the guts. Let those cure. That's already cured, right? Yep, okay. Um, go over here. Do I have wood in here? I have wood somewhere. But I don't remember where. Take the tinder uh, plug. Uh, I'll take some meat out because I'll probably eat that. Why not? Um, God, I have a lot of water in here. Quite a bit of food, too. Hell yeah, I'm pretty pretty stocked up. Let's start a fire and get rid of the wood that I'm carrying. And... Um, that way we can cook as well in a minute here. Cedar, fur, I'm just going to go ahead and add the fuel. I know I was saving that for something, but I can't remember what. Oh my god, I have a lot of food to cook. And I think I, I have wood in here somewhere? I think maybe I burned it all. I may have burned all of the food. Or, uh, burned all of the wood. Because I did a bunch of reclaimed wood. I cut up like everything inside this building and turned it into wood, I think, so... I don't know. I also don't know why I'm cooking all of this. But, uh, let's go ahead and eat. Because we are hungry. I think we're pretty hungry. Yeah, we're pretty hungry. Uh, salmon. We'll eat that. Um, am I still hungry? I'm still pretty hungry. I just ate an entire salmon. God, fatty boomba laddie over here. I think we can probably eat another one, almost. Wait, why is it at 53%? That's not, it's not full. Uh, and then we'll drink all of our water. All 1.2 kilograms of water. Apparently, too, okay, another thing that I really like about metrics one liter of water equals one kilogram in weight? That's so simple to remember! I mean, come on! Alright, let me go upstairs real quick and see if I have any wood. Because I know I stored... I stored some stuff up here. 